Hey Dan, thanks for coming by. Uh, I'm Nathan, running for mayor. I'm wondering if you could introduce yourself. Yeah, my name's Dan. I'm the president of the Langley City Firefighters Association. Oh, that's really great again that you're here talking to me today. As you know, community safety is really important for me. Uh, I, I know it's really important for you as a firefighter. I'm wondering if you could talk about uh, what it's like being a firefighter in Langley City right now. Is it pretty busy? Yeah, you know, over the last number of years, we've seen a significant increase in our call volume. Um, we've had, you know, the heat dome overdose crisis, um, a lot of a lot of major issues in the city that have increased our call volume significantly. And would it be fair to say that when you call 911, it's probably you that's responding? Yes, most of the time, um, about 75 to 80 percent of our calls now are medical assist calls, um, and the rest range from car accidents to fires to rescues, all of the above. So with SkyTrain coming, with our population growing, with high-rise apartments uh, coming, uh, does that kind of change how you respond to things in this community? Yeah, so those types of uh, incidents require a lot of specialized training. Um, they also require a lot more staff on scene, um, you know, within a timely manner. So those are things that we need to think about as our community grows and, and those um, types of infrastructure come into Langley City. Yeah, because right now I understand we have one full-time staff truck that can respond. Uh, when that truck is fully utilized, I know there's another sort of truck that works during the day, but if both of those are, are done, it can be a slower response. So we'd probably need, you know, more full-time. Yeah, so right now we have one fire truck staff 24-7, yeah. and then a second uh, fire truck staff, like you said, 25% of the time. Mm -hmm. um, so we, we really need to get that second truck staffed 100% of the time. It would make a big difference um, in response time, keeping the community safe and both our firefighters safe as well. Yeah, that's really important. And, you know, we've talked about community safety for a long time in Langley City. What I'm going to commit to you is that if I'm elected, I'm going to work with others on council to put a plan forward, recognizing SkyTrain's coming, recognizing our population's growing, uh, and more importantly, for that community safety plan, make sure that we uh, work on actually the recommendations of it and putting funding to it so that when people call 911, they know that you're going to respond. Right, and that's what we're looking for this election is a mayor and council that supports public safety. Well, it was really great chatting with you. I look forward to uh, talking with you more after the election. Sounds good. Thanks, Nathan. Great.